This is Tanya Davenport with Coldwell Banker High Country in the beautiful North Georgia mountains. I am in Gilmer County, standing um, on almost eight acres. This home is on the creek, creek frontage, and you can hear the water. It's uh, Tells Creek. Um, it's 7.97, so when I say that it's um, almost eight acres, it definitely is almost eight acres. The home is um, listed as a three bedroom, two bath. I'm gonna show you that home um, on the inside here in just a moment. Um, it is a turnkey property. So um, as you can see, let me try to pull my camera down here. There is a, um, the road goes um, around to the other side of the house and just has a, a place for you to turn around. So there's plenty of parking. The road is all private. And it's all well maintained. So as you can see, the, the property is uh, wooded. You could clear out if you wanted to or you can keep it pretty private. Um, before I finish video and I will go down to the creek and let you see um, the creek. There are a couple of neighbors that you can see across the road, but they're they're off in the distance. So I've gotten a little bit closer to the house so you can see it. It's pretty well maintained. The home is a 1983, so I, I, I kind of want to say that there um, have been add-ons to the um, property. It's a total of 2154. Um, on the main floor, you've got 1,642 square feet. There's not any bedrooms on the main floor, but there is a bathroom. Oh, and there's somebody sitting here. <laughs> Uh, all right, my assistant has taken a break, it looks like. So the bedrooms are upstairs, but I want to show you this is all open. It's kind of like a hunter's cabin with as small as the kitchen is. There's no woman wanting to use this kitchen for fixing um, Thanksgiving dinner for the whole family if, if they purchase this home. Wouldn't be hard to update though. Oh, and so uh, special remarks on the um, MLS is that the seller will contribute some money towards an update of the kitchen. All right, so you've got so you've got a bathroom um, that comes off of the kitchen here, stand up shower. As you can see, there's hardwood floors, and that's pretty much throughout the home. And then you've got a single vanity. And when I had mentioned how the property um, has, well, let me just show you, this is kind of like a little mud area, it has the driveway off this side. Turnkey, there's a grill there too. There's where the driveway ends. And that's where I come down just to see a little bit more of the, um, the actual property and turned around. Um, so it was great Great additional parking, and you have a place to walk up and come in, like I said, as a mudroom. So the deck goes all the way around the front of the house, so you'd have some nice family time out here. And I'm sure you can hear the creek. You got a little fire pit out there and a hammock. Okay, so there is doors um, from the living area right there near the fireplace that walk out to the front porch too. So this home used to be on the rental program, but the people that have owned it have not had it on there. And that is a propane fireplace, but you can see that at one time that it, it was a uh, wood burning fireplace has a chimney. If you wanted to do that, I would definitely recommend having it inspected just to make sure that it's um, okay to do that. So right here, you have a step down, and this takes you to a concrete area. It's all block. Whoops. Sorry, as most know that have watched my videos, I'm not so great with the stabilizer. But you've got this as a little game area, and you've got your laundry. 
And Dawson says he likes this home. Oh, oh no. Oh, he likes a picture frame that's up here on the wall. So, you know, like I had said, it's all turnkey. Um, so he has made um, in his shop class an American flag, but that one really is nice. It stands out. And it's very, it's very fitting. Um, this is the weekend of the 4th. So God bless America. All right, so here we are going upstairs to the bedrooms. There's sheetrock. So I apologize, my phone started ringing and it knocked me off of videoing. So the ceilings here are wood. It's a good size and this is a king size bed. Let's see what the closets look like. They're fairly good size. You have a bathroom. And I asked my assistant to help me out here and turn on lights, but it looks like he didn't do so good. So it is a small vanity. And then you have a nice tall shower. So this part's been updated. It's definitely not 1983. And then you've got the other um, bedroom that is very large as well. King size beds in here. And then you've got the same closet it's pretty much the same footprint as the other bedroom. So now when, like I had said that um, at the beginning of the video, it is listed as a three bedroom, two bath. So you've got the bathroom on the main floor and you've got the bathroom um, on the upstairs. That, that bedroom that they're considering as the third is this um, area where the game room is. And so um, people need to take that in consideration when they're looking at this property. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pause the video and go out to the creek side and then um, show you um, the, the beauty from there and then give you a little bit more information about the property. Okay. All right, so I am standing on the um, other side in front of the house. And when I say other side, the little driveway that's going in front of the home. Now that is a private driveway, so you're not gonna have to worry about anybody coming down and, and bothering you. So you can enjoy um, the privacy of this um, nearly eight acres. Here is that noisy Tails Creek. Lots of um, family time can be spent out here. My, if, if Delilah and Dawson were together helping me today, I would have them down here at the creek. I wouldn't even have any help up at the house. They really enjoy coming to properties that have um, water to play at. And so you've got that road there, but it is private because there's a gate there. You see that it just leads to this home. So even this road that's on the other side is um, not an active road or a busy road. So um, you do really have a private setting. It is right off of Tells Creek um, Road, but it's it's pretty quiet. The, the noise has been um, washed out um, of a road because of the creek. So just to recap, like I had mentioned, the house is listed as a three bedroom, but there's really truly only two. You could convert the game room into a bedroom if you um, had interest. There is that crawl space. I do not have a key for it, so I can't get into it to let you know what it looks like on the inside. Um, the total square footage of the home that's listed on the tax assessors is 2154. The kitchen does need updating if you're wanting to um, have any kind of major entertaining. You know, it could be used as is um, for some time being. Um, it is on a private well. 
and um, Total Creek frontage. The home was built in 1983. It is listed for $512,000. It's not been on the market very long. If you have any more interest in this property, don't hesitate to reach out to me. Um, and I can get you more information. There is a plat available. Um, and there are not any restrictions here. This is just a private, unrestricted property. My number is 706-455-6977, Tanya Davenport with Coldwell Banker in the beautiful North Georgia mountains.